Coalition Group, the Yoruba Appraisal Forum, YAF, said self-determination plan by any ethnic nationality, especially the Yorubas, posed greater danger to the Nigerian nation. As part of its continuous peaceful campaigns against groups agitating for the secession of the southwest from Nigeria, the Forum YAF on Friday stormed Adoikiti, it is a state and Akure, Ondo state capital, to sensitize prominent indigents on the need to strengthen the Nigerian nationhood. The coalition described as devilish alleged plans by some Yoruba secessionist groups to work for the breakup of Nigeria, warning that this could lead to a second civil war in the country while insisting that the unity of the country remained non-negotiable. It is also faulted caused by some Yoruba leaders for the dis dis dismemberment of Nigeria and secession of the southwest region from the rest of the country. It therefore called on the federal government and the various security agencies to take urgent and decisive action against secession agitators in the southwest. YAF National Coordinator Adeshino Animashaun, who led other members during their visit to the two states, appealed to the six governors and other major stakeholders in the southwest to rise to the challenge and stop plans by secession agitators and some Yoruba elders, backing them to cause chaos in the region. Animashaun restated that the aims and objectives of the most vociferous of these disparate groups known as the Yoruba World Congress, which claims to be the umbrella body of these amorphous groups, were patently suspects. Those people, by their nefarious and unpatriotic activities, are bent on bringing hardship and disaster to the peace-loving people of the Southwest, he said. Animashan recalled that the YWC President General Professor Banji Akintoye in a press statement had disclosed that the membership of the Yoruba speaking nation of the UMPO was contained in a letter addressed to him through the YWC coordinator for Europe by the UP, UMPO Secretary General Ralph Bunches, saying, Your Excellency, the antics and body language of the YWC are enough clear indications that the sinister plans by some of these so-called Yoruba self-determination groups and their leaders like Professor Akintoye to lead their innocent and unsuspecting people to secede from Nigeria, he said. The YAF coordinator noted that with Amotekun under the control of YWC, it was planning to sustain unprovoked attacks and intensify the provocation of other Nigerians, especially Northerners, in the pursuit of their selfish and devilish aim of seceding and dismembering Nigeria. Anima Shaun therefore stressed that YAF was not in support of any person or groups clamor clamoring for the secession of Yoruba land from Nigeria. The forum also seized the opportunity to present petitions to a Kiti state governor, Dr. Fayemi, Kayo de Fayemi, its Undo state counterpart, Governor Rosi Miyakure Dolu S.A.N., Speaker of the Ekiti State House of Assembly, Right Honorable Fuminiyi Afuye, Speaker of the Ondo State House of Assembly, Right Honorable Bamidele Uluye Logun, and prominent traditional rulers in the two states. Okay. Royal father visited by the YAF in the two states include the Ewe of Adrekiti, Oba Dr. Rufus Adeyemo, Ade Jube, Adlade Somi Ugoga of Ikerekiti, Oba Ade Goye. Aka Yejo Olojodu of Idwekiti Oba Ilori Faboro Ajero of Ijero Ikiti Oba Joseph Adebayo Adewole Tu Ele Kole of Ikole Oba Adewumi Ajibade Fasiku and Chairman of Ikiti Kwelu Kwelu Obas and the Alawe of Ilawe Ikiti Oba Adebanji Ajibade Alabi uh, the coalition also petitioned the traditional rulers in Ondo State, including Chairman of Ondo State Traditional Rulers Council and Ulubo of Ubo, Oba Dr. Frederick Obateru Akirunton, Deji of Akure, Oba Alade Toyimbo Odundun, Wan, Olowo of Owo, Oba Gbade Gesin, 
Osimawe of Undu Oba Dr. Victor Adesumbo Kila Dejo and Jega of Ile Uloju Oba Adetimei. Well, at least from what we can hear from this whole thing is that some group are saying, no, they don't want secession of Nigeria. You are, you are not going from places to places. You are now doing a campaign. Good and fine. My question is that you people said some people should not agitate for, for breakup. Then the Nigeria, what Nigeria you are clamoring for? What have you done concerning the state of the nation? What have you done concerning the things happening? A lot of issues happening in the Nigeria because something led to something. These people did not just wake up and say, oh, everything is fine. Then we just want to leave. When you are filled, when you are full, when you are already eating, you cannot, if you see food, you will, not, you will not be hungry again. Problems like this cannot be happening and you expect people to fold their hands. People have talked about restructuring. You guys said no, that restructuring is not the issue. We are not even arguing it. Any way is a way, in as much it is going to be a genuine way. If you are talking about one Nigeria, good and fine. What are the things that you have done to make sure that, okay, everybody is happy in, in this one Nigeria? The hypocrisy about, hypocrisy about uh, some people is just so halami. Now, the problem happening in the country, you guys are not talking about it. We know what is happening in your state. In Okiti State, Ondo State, this same issue of s men you guys are not saying anything. You are not going from places to places to tell even the federal government to and to 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 undo this uh, so-called s men Biyeti Allah, they have come out on several occasions to make statements, a categorical statement. They, they they were not economical with the truth. They are not trying to be diplomatic. They said it directly that this country belongs to them and they are going to take over. They said it. It's not as if uh, somebody is trying to change their ways. It was. It is in the public domain. You heard it. And you guys did not come out to say anything. People, like people's lives are being taken on a daily basis. You guys are not worried about it. Once they just talk about a uh, break up a uh, restructuring you people don't want to to hear about it good governance you are still going to be making excuses these same people they will be telling you by the time you start to ask them questions they will answer you and they will tell you that yes we know that there are challenges here and there just like a uh, the uh, former apc chairman chief uh, john oyegun saying that they know a lot of things have been happening but they are on the right track laying the foundation at this age and time they are still laying foundation i'm sure if any of their relatives we are not even talking of far relation relation we are talking of your children any of your children or your wife is involved or are the victims of all these things that we are talking about i'm sure they will not be speaking like this because they believe that it's, it's far away eh, it can happen to other people's children but it cannot happen to them maybe you have a better your orientation will change because it has it's not affecting them. And you know the reason why it's not affecting them? Because they've already they have they've surrendered they, they've surrounded themselves. They have safeguarded themselves. Nothing of such will touch them. Alternatively, most of them, their children are not even in the country. They themselves that are the ones that are in the country, they are safe, you know, securing them. They will not even encounter all those problems that everyday Nigerian is encountering. These people are not going from state to state. Now, like uh, the Malian Esme that are that are disturbing people in uh, in or your community, you guys did not see all those things. Danny Adams will come out. You will tell him to shut up. You tell him to keep quiet. That he does not know what he's talking about. Auguste, the same thing. People are complaining. The same or your the same on those states that you are going. The same Ekiti state you are going. People are crying. What has been done to 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 their cry? Nothing. But you guys can be going from places to places. If you want the one Nigeria, then go about the one Nigeria. Some people will see comments that they want one Nigeria, but they want good governance. The same set of people will still tell you that, uh, what is your problem? What is their problem? What are you looking for? That the government is doing well. I don't just understand. I don't just understand where we are going in this country. Call for one Nigeria to do the right thing. They won't do it. Call for restructuring. They will say, oh, oh. People are talking about a breakup. To go their own way you said no it is not possible that government and the security agents to go and deal with them do the right thing people are dying you have, did you call the government and the security people to to undo this uh, uh SMA and all this uh, whatever devices that we are we are we are encountering poverty is there hunger is there everything is 
or in, or in, in, in everything is in disarray. You guys are not bothered about that. But you are going, you have that energy. Of course, maybe there are some people who are pushing them. There's no problem. If you want one Nigeria, let's protest and tell the government to do the right thing. You see that by default, everything will be okay. You are not doing the right thing and you want people just to continue to, to, be, to be bearing it. It's not done. I don't understand these people. I don't understand them. Maybe it is the same government that is really sponsoring these people because maybe there, there's something you guys are benefiting. If you are benefiting something, maybe you can speak, you know, from that angle, yes, that uh, those who are calling for secession should not be listened to. Hmm. Well, the Omali, the Omali is in our midst. Traitors and saboteurs are everywhere. Very disgusting. So these people are comfortable with the way things are in this uh, contraption. But wait, to where are all these groups? When Fulani, exactly, where are they? Where are they? They will tell you, you no. Know, the same set of people, they will tell you, oh, uh, stop uh, tagging these uh, Fulani people. That they, Some people are disguising, using them. Up to now, people are still disguising, using them. See what is happening in Castina State, in, in Kaduna, in, or even in Bono State. No, they are the people are disguising, using them. These are the statements I've been hearing from the Southwest, or so some of these people from the Southwest. They will say, oh, everybody, if there's somebody shit, if somebody talk, oh, she say, you're full of yes, man. Let them continue. It's true. Where, where were they when all these old things have been happening? So, guys, let's say your opinion. Leave your comment below and let us know your thoughts on this issue. Thank you.